Kaizen is implemented through the following seven steps. Step one, select the Kaizen theme. Step two, conduct situation analysis. Step three, identify the root cause of the problem. Step four, identify potential solutions. Step five, implement the best solution. Step six, check the effectiveness of the solution. Step seven, standardize the solution. In simple terms, the seven steps of the Kaizen process can be simplified into the following four stages. Plan, do, check, act. The cycle of plan, do, check, act must be continuously repeated over weeks, months, and years. Kaizen thus involves a series of planning, implementing, checking, and revisiting activities to continuously improve performance. Kaizen reduces seven types of waste in the workplace. One, overproduction. Occurs when we produce more output than needed. Two, inventory arises when we store more inputs or outputs than needed. Three, waiting. It is unnecessary wait of people or things until a work cycle is completed. Four, motion. Is an unnecessary movement of people or machines that wastes energy. Transportation is an unnecessary movement of things that consumes time and resources. Six, rework is an unnecessary repetition of tasks and activities. Seven, over-processing happens when we process goods or services beyond the required standard. The 5S framework provides principles for organizing the workplace. These are the following. One, sort. Identify the most important ideas, tasks, or plans. Focus on them and give up everything that is unnecessary. Two, straighten. Arrange important things in a way that makes it easy to use them. Three, shine. Clean the workplace at a set interval of time. Cleaning and inspection keep equipment and machinery in good order and improve safety. Four, standardize. Pick the best practices for a given task and stick to those practices. Five, sustain. Improve upon the other four S's through continued reflection and training. Managers can monitor the organization of a specific workplace based on the 5S framework. This figure shows the performance of the Ward 7 workplace over a few months in 2013 and 2014. By measuring the 5S practices regularly, managers can understand what areas need improvement. Please follow the website link and QR code on the side to watch a short YouTube video. Can you identify the seven types of waste in this video? Please indicate how the 5S practices can reduce waste in the workplace. The first stage in implementing Kaizen is identifying a theme 
or a problem that needs to be solved or improved. Since employees have the best knowledge of what is needed in their workplace, a Kaizen theme should be selected through bottom-up process of employee engagement. A Kaizen theme can address problems workers are facing in their workplace, potential changes that enhance workers' effectiveness, efficiency, and safety, issues raised by internal and external clients. A feasibility assessment matrix can be used to select among various Kaizen themes. Such a feasibility matrix can address, assess the importance of a Kaizen theme based on its potential business impact, social impact, environmental impact, urgency, resource demand, etc. Once a Kaizen theme is selected for implementation, a modified form of the feasibility matrix can also be used to assess the effectiveness of different potential solutions. The table provides an illustrative example of how such a matrix can be used to assess the feasibility different potential solutions for a Kaizen theme. This discussion question asks you to reflect on opportunities for sustainable business in your country or community. This and other discussion questions will be posted on the online platform. Please log in the online platform and provide your response to the question. Your participation in the forum will qualify you for bonus grades, boost your marks for this course. Thank you for your attention and for making time to watch this lecture. The next lecture will be posted on the online platform early next week. Until the next lecture, goodbye.